peace. It's been a minute. So I wanted to come on really quickly. Um, it's been a minute because first let's start off with that. I honestly just didn't really want to make a video. Um, not only that, but a lot has been going on. So I, in the field that I'm in, I talk a lot and I just didn't feel like talking. Um, I've been really busy with um, my job. And then I know I also talked about focusing on my health, which has also been a challenge coupled with this kind of job, this type of job. Um, so I still drink my water, drink a lot of herbal teas. Um, I've gotten rid of the habit of snacking, um, un with eating unhealthy snacks. So I usually eat grapes for snack if I'm going to eat eat a snack um, or some type of nut, maybe. Um, but it's still, as I still have not met my goal as far as the weight loss. Um, what else? So as far as, so I will make another video maybe in the next week or two, maybe. Um, I just do a lot of talking for my job and it's, it, and I give a lot for my job. So it's really draining. And, um, I'm in school and so it's just, it's just been a number of things going on. Um, the other, so what I wanted to talk about was my hair. Um, you know, I thought once it got to this length, it's like, at the beginning of my tailbone um in the back um and so I thought once I get to this length I wouldn't have that much to talk about but it's just an ongoing process or ongoing journey it's it's constantly trans it transforms um but what I'm finding that is that it transforms when I'm not really paying attention to it um, so in the, one of my videos last year, um, I talked about how in the beginning my hair was forming sort of like this on both sides. So this was coming this way in a clump, in a clump and on this side as well. Well, it's forming like that again. And I have been, <clears throat> excuse me, trying to decide whether or not I'm going to pull this apart. Um, for one, my texture of hair, I, I, I kind of, I don't want it to look skinny or it, it's because my texture is fine. Um, but I will say this, also cleaning it when it's this thick is, is, is also a challenge. But I'm not I'm I'm not a hundred percent sure that I'm gonna do that because I really do want it to form on its own. And I just think it's so creative to watch it um evolve or develop. Uh, that that is something that's creatively divine about it to me. So I'm not certain if I'm going to um, pull them apart. But what I will say is that I do know that if I don't, I only want seven locks. And I, I don't remember the number that I started off with, but for a long time I had about 17. Then it went from 17 to 13. And now I'm, I'm at seven and I really like, that's my favorite number. I just, connect with the energy of the number seven and what that means um, on a spiritual level, if you want to say that, call it that. Um, and so, I don't know. I just want seven locks. So I'm thinking about not, no, I know that I'm not going to let um, them combine anymore. 
than what they have. Um, if if more are growing um, out, which there are a lot of little teeny things. I love this little thing. Uh, it's has it's it's doing its own thing. Um, yeah, it's something about the number seven for me. So, um, I kind of just do not want to pull these apart, though. I cannot lie. I really don't. The other reason why I was considering pulling them apart is because of my daughter. She says, you're going to only have, if you let those, these two combine on, you know, right here and right here. What if the others in the back combine and you only have three locks? I would love that if my texture was different. Um, I'm not too sure about that happening with my hair texture. Um, I don't style my hair. I really don't. I might put it in a ponytail. And I kind of do want that option to be able to put it in a ponytail. But, um, yeah, so it's like, how many? One, two, three, and a little skinny one. And then four. And then on this side, we got one, two, three, four. Um, but it is combining into one here, one here, and then I have five in the back. And I love that. Um, I've been spraying rose water in it and also a concoction I found or learned about on TikTok, which is, um, fenugreek seed um uh tea some type of tea i can't remember the tea and then it's supposed to be rosemary i didn't have any rosemary um so that was missing um from the concoction um but i love it i absolutely love it so i'm gonna get some rosemary and add that to the mix but anyway so yeah, the reason why I haven't been on, which I want to say thank you to the subscribers that are that have stuck with me. Um there have been a couple that have left. Um I don't know. I'm I'm an introvert by nature. And then on top of that, as I stated, I talk for my job a lot to different people. And it can be draining. And I'm just giving, giving and giving. And so I don't know. I pulled back away and I wanted to focus on the things I need to focus on, which is, um, like I said, my health and the challenges with that. And then the challenges with my job and just there's some challenges that that are causing me to grow. And I just feel like sometimes I need to pull away from social media, if that makes sense. So anyway. I just wanted to come on really quickly and I will do another video within the either next weekend or the weekend after next. Um, yeah, I think I'm going to wait until January um, to do another video. Possibly, maybe, maybe, we'll see. All right. Thanks for watching. Thanks for sticking around. Um, I'm trying to think if there was something else. Nope, that's it. Peace.